Welcome back, Citizens One and All. We're back with more Dinkum, and today we are going to be speaking with Franklin. We're going to talk about the quarry, which we've not talked about yet, but it is a substantially good item. So let's make one now. Make it. We are tracking everything needed. This stuff here, so it's an engine. A couple of these, a couple of these, one of each of these. I think it's, I think it's five, three, one, and one. And the one, 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 five, and three. We're, we're making a handful right now. We, we're sitting on one. We're going to go place right now. And then we're going to talk about what the quarry does itself. And it's actually pretty cool. So daily, it will pull up one item from underground. And it'll pull up to four items total. So when you place them, you want to place them like this. So you see we have two spaces here, so each spot can have an item. And then we do the same going this way, so. Overall very cool. I like it because it gives you the barrels more than anything, but it'll give you all of the ores as well as a chance for opals. So I would advise having 10 to 15 of these if you want to go crazy and do more. I have seen people do upwards of 100. So there's a, there's a lot of room to explore with these and it's going to make your life forgetting the components just that much easier. But that is the quarry in a nutshell. Y'all take care, enjoy Dinkum, and I hope to see you in the next stream.